Hello Leo, this is Gypsy Spirit here, ready to give you your love reading for May. And um, I've already drawn your cards, and these are very interesting cards. And I say that because I'm a Leo as well, and so I'm looking at these cards, and I'm like, oh, really? Uh, so, <laughs> just please bear in mind, this is a general read. So, you know, it may apply to a relationship. For, for some, it may be a relationship. For others, it may be job. I, you know, just whatever you know, fits your storyline. Um, but if you want your own personal reading, you can go to my website that's listed below in the description box and it will take you to my web, or you can find my website and get your own personal reading. So, um, also, let's see, what else do I have to tell you? Uh, oh, if you like this video, please hit the like button. Also, if you want to subscribe to my channel, please hit the subscribe button. That way you'll get a notice every time I put something out. But in the meantime, Leo, let's get started. I've got some bonus cards here for you. Um, I got the map oracle and the flower oracle cards um, as bonus cards to read. And let's go ahead and get started. Um, very interesting cards, Leo. <laughs> and again, I'm a Leo, and I'm like, oh. Okay, so here's the Two of Pentacles here, which I can kind of relate to this. This is all about finding balance, balancing money, your finances. Um, and this is the Sun card, one of the best cards in the whole deck, I think. And then also um, your Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Here we go, balancing that money again. So it looks like um, for some of you, um, there you're trying to find balance in your life with with work money and then also uh, your personal life as well I know for myself I am in that situation where I'm trying to find some balance and and you know where I, I'm making money but I'm also trying to do something else as well so I'm trying to find balance in that so for some of you you're definitely um, you know concerned about your finances trying to find the balance and, um, you know, you're, you're just, it's like you're playing a juggling act, you know. Uh, some of you may have two jobs or more, and you're trying to find some balance with all that as you also try to uh, maintain like a, a normal life, if, you know, whatever you consider normal. Um, but that is there also. But you also have the sun card, so in spite of the things that you know, seem to be, you know, uneven or, you know, you're trying to do this juggling act with your, your finances and your life and everything, you know, there, you know, there's some happiness there. You know, you're reaching, your energy is really good. Um, it's like you've got hope and promise in everything that you're doing and, um, you know, you, you just have this feel good energy about you. You know, like sometimes, um, uh, we, we are, having we we could be having financial struggles or whatever and feel really down and out but what i'm getting from the sun card with you is that you know you're just plugging right along and and, and your energy is good and you're not giving up hope you're not you're not giving up you know that um this you know if your finances are in trouble or whatever it just might be a little temporary thing because you're not a quitter um leo's usually are not um also, you have the Ace of Pentacles. Well, and this is in reverse as well. So, you know, you might have some ideas in making money that maybe don't pan out. But um, that's, you know, there's nothing to be upset about that. This is just for a month. Um, and usually it's, <laughs> I don't know about for you, but for me, you know, my money situation, you know, like around the beginning of the summer kind of sucks. Then it gets a little bit better. And then by the time Christmas rolls around, it sucks again. And of course, you know, that's when we're supposed to be buying Christmas presents and everything. And I don't have any money. That's usually how my life works out. So um, I don't know if that works for any of you or not. <laughs> but anyway, um, you know, your flower card. Yeah, I mean, it's like, Leo, you're not giving up. And, and Leo's, you know, we, we're, um, we're strong people, you know. We don't, we don't just throw in the towel very easily. And so um, your card uh, is the Orchid card. And it is telling you to reach for the stars. 
Uh, you deserve only the best, and this is all you should focus your attention on. And so that's why you've got the sun card right here, honey, because you, you know, you, you do know that you're you're worthy, and you do deserve the best. And so that's that's why you know, even though your your finances look like they might be in limbo, but I mean, you're not giving up. You're just moving on. And maybe what didn't work, you know, one time for you. Um, you ha are figuring out ways to um, make the adjustments that you need to make to make so that whatever it is you want to do will start working for you. So and, and so it's great. I mean, you you're giving up. You're not giving up any um, hope, or you're not giving up on the dream, or whatever. You're just, you know, you just keep tugging away at it. Um, you know, and I say this in some of my videos. I love to watch biographies, especially like on YouTube, uh, with rock stars or um, famous, famous people. And Led Zeppelin, I, you know, I'm a huge Led Zeppelin fan. And I was listening uh, to um, some type of biography or something. And Robert Plant was, his very first band that he sang for, they fired him. Because the manager of that band said that he couldn't sing. <laughs> Really? <laughs> so, um, you know, and speaking of Robert Plant, he's a Leo too. So, you know, he didn't give up. He just kept going. Um, so, yeah, Leo, don't give up. I mean, you're you're going to start shining soon. You're going to find that little niche or whatever. But your map card is, you know, it's perfect. Into the unknown. And so, I mean, you're, you're in a good spot because, like I said, you've got this great energy about you knowing that, Whatever it is that you're doing, you're, something's going to happen. You know that that you're going to to succeed in some way or another. But um, also at the same time, um, you know that some of the things that you're doing might be a little scary because they're new to you, and and you're creating new things for yourself, and and so it, it can be a little scary because you're going into territories that you're you. You're not used to, but that's what life is all about. That's you know that's part of growing, and uh, so good luck to you, Leo. Um, anyway, I hope this helps you. If not, <laughs> um, but if you have any comments or any questions, please feel free to leave a comment or question. Um, I always answer my comments, and um, we'll get to you as you know as quick. I might not get to you right away, but I will. Um, thank you so much, Leo, for listening, and until I see you next time, bye-bye.